Tony, you said the other night in Charlottesville after the game that this team, maybe more than some others you've had, needed to be connected on defense to do well. Where yeah. Where was the disconnect today? Yeah, I mean, our ball pressure wasn't great. Our ability to keep the ball in front, um, just a lot of breakdowns. And Notre Dame did a good job, obviously, hit some tough shots, uh, shot it well. Um, but they had us in rotations, and, and we just had a hard time. You know, ball screen defense, you can point at everything, but you know, you, to stay connected to a team that gets hot at home, um, you have to at least make them earn. And OK, a few of them they did, but then all of a sudden when there are those disconnections or the breakdowns that allow to an easy layup or a, a forgetful play or a gamble um, and the game gets separated, we're not, um, we don't have enough offensive firepower to, to just say, all right, we can kind of exchange possessions and we'll get it going and score in a flurry. Um, even, and I thought we got pretty good looks early. And, you know, that puts, it does put pressure on your defense when you're missing either some clean looks or bunnies. Uh, and then you know you got to get stops. But that's just the way it is. Whether you like it or not, you're going to have to be um, harder to score against than we are, or this will continually happen to us. We'll take one in front. Were you uh, surprised at all at, at the effort Notre Dame put forth? I mean, uh, you know, they've been off for a while. I think I think they got a guy or two healthy, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe not. Um, but uh, no, they they played with great spirit. I mean, they're we're inexperienced. They're young and inexperienced as well, um, and we couldn't handle early um, the young man Jr. I mean, he just kind of put his shoulder down and bullied us, and he hit the you know some tough shots. Um, we were out of you know got us in rotations, um, but no, they they run good stuff. They played hard. Um, and you know they're really trying to get some stuff established, and and we were certainly kind of took a punch early, and didn't respond, um, and weren't sound enough and consistent enough to get back in that game, which was frustrating. Thanks, Jeff, I know you don't want to get off to a slow start anywhere, but is it more concerning when it happens on the road, like it did at Houston too? At Memphis, you mean? At Memphis. Memphis. Yeah, it did happen at Houston yeah. about three years ago. If you want to go back and check the records. Um, or two years ago, whatever it was, right? But thanks for reminding me of that, Jeff. Uh, to kick a guy when he's down. Um, I think, um, yeah, no, at Memphis, and it's what I said after, you know, it, it, you don't necessarily win a game in the first four or five minutes, and you don't necessarily lose a game, but you make it incredibly difficult when you get down like that. And, you know, Memphis, you know, we were down 13 to 1, and we did fight back. Um, and then in this one, whatever it, it happened. Uh, so you, you have to, again, I thought the shots were there. Early, so we just missed some shots. But uh, defensively, we really had a hard time. Just felt like we were behind the play and um, didn't have a lot of uh, tenacity and soundness uh, where it was needed. And then, you know, whether it's a, an offensive rebound or a silly foul that puts them uh, quicker in the penalty, all those things, they add up, and it just compounded. Notre Dame had not been shooting the ball well, but when you reviewed its film, did you feel like they were getting good looks? They yeah. Yeah, I mean, they shoot, uh, I think, 45, 46% of their shots are threes. And you know, we always said that, you know, if they get it going, they're a dangerous team. And they got it going partly because of good stuff. And they, they hit some tough shots. And then some of it was us um, just being, uh, you know, good defense is, is there. It's, it's there in the catch. You're making them shoot the contested shots. And there are too many uncontested shots, whether, again, they got us in rotations or we broke down. So that. Um, that was a problem when they got it going, and uh, we didn't have the wherewithal to stop the bleeding. Okay. Go ahead, Jeff. What do you? What is the message to the team after after a game like this? Yeah, I'm. You know, again, uh, it's just the ability to. You know, um, you sit, stay together, don't hang your head, all the stuff you'd say, but you know, take a good look. All of us look in the mirror and say, "This has happened now. Uh, we've gotten taken." We've gotten beat pretty handily for sure three times um, and haven't been able to, to hang in there. And whether it's a hot team or you're playing a team that's mature and good and experienced, you just got to find ways. So we, we all got to come together in five ways. Um, but it's going to take a, a real connected, uh, unified effort, first defensively, because um, when the defense goes, um, it's not good. And, and today the defense was, was, it was, it was gone. Um, they took it from us. And then we were uh, weren't able to even stay in that game. So we'll get at, we'll get back to work, uh, play again on Wednesday, and and again we're one and one in the league, and hopefully we can regroup and and fight and get back to it. Okay, take one more here. Tony, the 
obviously hired Coach Guerra away from you yep. last year. Is, is that an, a big deal today, or how do you deal with um, that? No. Did you get to visit with him pregame? Just a little bit pregame, so uh, his daughter and his wife. Um, no, nah, Coach Getter really helped us get to the spot we got to. Um, and, you know, he um, – yeah, no, he knows all of our stuff. I mean, we're doing some different stuff. We've changed some things, but this was about um, us not – performing the best and then playing good stuff. And I'm sure he has things that he knows we struggle with and uh, all that. So, you know, kudos to him. And again, Notre Dame's trying to, you know, build their program and um, they got some good young players. And, you know, again, we got some some good young players, but we got to get it right. And so we'll, we'll keep figuring it out.